Hi, I'm Craig. Welcome to the battery shop. The 12 volt battery in this 2018 Tesla Model X is located right here under the hood. It's positioned behind the inner compartment of the frunk. Before we begin, check with the manufacturer's step-by-step -step instructions so you're familiar with the project, you have everything you need, you don't forget anything, and can safely and efficiently replace the battery in this vehicle. Here's how it's done. The first step is to remove the four trim panels. The next step is to remove the carpet. You'll need to remove the tabs for the front lights. and then remove the fasteners for the frunk compartment. You'll need a 10 millimeter wrench for that. Next, push the wires through. And remove the front compartment. The next step is to remove the HEPA filter housing. Most vehicles will have the filter right here. Next is the most important step, and that is to remove the first responder loop. With gloves and safety glasses on, push down on the tab and remove the connector. With gloves and safety glasses on, the next step is to remove the negative battery cable from the negative battery terminal. You'll need a 10 millimeter wrench for that. And remove the negative battery cable from the negative battery terminal. Then remove the positive battery cable's protective cover. And loosen the fastener using your 10 millimeter wrench. And then remove the positive battery cable from the positive battery terminal.
and tuck this out of the way. The next step is to remove the upper fasteners for the battery tray. You'll need a 13 millimeter wrench for that. and then remove the lower fasteners for the battery tray using a 10 millimeter wrench. Then remove the plastic clip on the upper bolt and the clip above the battery. Then remove the vent tube. Now we can remove the tray with the battery inside. Next remove the fastener for the hold down clip. You'll need a 10 millimeter wrench for that. and remove the clip. Then remove the old battery and install the replacement battery. And the battery hold down clip and reinstall the fastener. The next step is to install the battery tray and battery. Now we can install the upper fasteners for the battery tray. and then the lower fasteners. and replace the clips and the clip on the upper bolt and reinstall the vent tube. The next step is to reinstall the positive battery cable onto the positive battery terminal. But don't pound these clamps on because this can cause internal battery damage. and tighten the fastener. And then reinstall the negative battery cable onto the negative battery terminal. And tighten the fastener. Next, reinstall the first responder loop. Then we can reinstall the HEPA filter housing. and the front compartment. Music 
and reinstall the fasteners. and reinstall the carpet. Then reconnect the front light connectors. And finally, reinstall the four trim panels. Many late model vehicles have to have their replacement battery registered or coded with the vehicle's battery management system. Refer to the service and repair manual for your vehicle to see if this needs to be done. If so, check out our videos on how to do this. The links to them are in the video's description below.